Patty Christensen again, Hand Sarah PS Lady. Uh, just a quick video for what the freeze dryer looks like when it is um, done. I don't know if you can see this. That's ice. It's that much ice all the way. Can you see how much ice there is? That's a lot of ice. And the reason there's a lot of ice is because the milk and the onions were very, very, very liquidy. It also means it takes a lot longer to, um, to dry. So, and so that is why when you're freeze drying, if it's very, very liquidy, it's going to take a long time. And then when you're done, there's going to be a whole lot of ice in there. And you have two options with the ice. One is you can press the drum heater and it'll heat it up and it'll melt it a lot faster. I do that if I have lots of things to get done, right? So I'm just impatient. Whereas for this one, I don't have anything left that I need to do. So frankly, I don't waste the electricity of using the heaters and I just leave, um, leave it natural, crack the door a little and just let it just, you know, uh, on its own, um, you know, thaw and, and drain. So that next time, of course, it'll all be done. It's very important that you thaw it out between each load because otherwise you can get that ice build up and it can be damaging to the machine, to the food, to everything. Thanks.